Well, greetings on this New Year's Eve day. I pray it's going to be a safe one for you and a good one for you. I'm Pastor Ken Harvest Church out in Lexington. Hope you'll plan to join us on Sunday, right? Get all uh, ready to roll into a new year with us. Amen. Here's our thought for today. We're talking about lessons from Mary's life. Let me read yesterday's verse again. Go into the thought I have for you for today. Luke 1 not one promise from God is empty of power for nothing is impossible with God. And then the Bible says, and Mary responded, she said, this is amazing. Listen, this is amazing. As his servant, let it be. I accept whatever the Lord has for me. What a great attitude. What a great attitude to recognize that God's presence in God's promise is God's inherent power. And where there's the power of God, I can say this is amazing because I know whatever God's will is for me, for 2021, I know the Lord is with me. We're ending the old. 2020 is behind us. We don't know what to expect in 2021, but I can expect this, the presence, the promise, and the power of God in my life. This is amazing. I want God to be amazing in your life in this coming year. May I pray with you? Will you consider that God, through Jesus Christ, our Savior, can be amazing in your life as He was little Mary's? I want to pray with you this morning. I'll be right back. Pray with me. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray you would watch over everyone today and through this weekend. But Lord, I also pray that you would be with them. I pray that the presence of the Most High God, the Almighty God, and the power of the Almighty God would be upon each one, that they would feel the anointing and grace of Jesus Christ as we move into a new year. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen and amen. The Lord bless you. Happy New Year. Be safe.